Here we will demonstrate how to apply local anaesthetic to labial tears by form of an injection. The medical model shows one torn labium. The wound edges require suturing to ensure a healthy healing process and an acceptable cosmetic result. Use a small subcutaneous needle similar to the ones used for administering vitamin K to the newborn. The size of the needle allows you to administer small doses. The point of the needle is very fine and therefore reduces the risk of painful injection to the tissue. Local analgesia is injected subcutaneously directly into the wound edges. You can hold the wound edges to the side to get a better view of the tear. Inject the anaesthetic into the subcutaneous tissue. Then, inject a small amount into the tip of the labium. This is followed by injecting the anaesthetic in small doses along the wound edges to ensure pain relief in the area you are about to suture. Repeat this with a maximum distance of half a centimeter between each dose. The outer parts of the wound edges are now anesthetized using the same method. First, small doses in the subcutaneous tissue, followed by small doses along the wound edges. Be careful not to accidentally jab yourself with the needle. We will also apply anesthesia to the upper part of the tear. We start with applying local anaesthetic in the subcutaneous tissue. This is the tissue in between the skin edges. Inject the anaesthetic into the subcutaneous tissue using small doses. Now the anaesthetic is applied directly onto the wound edges with a maximum distance of half a centimeter. This ensures that the local anaesthetic is applied evenly on the wound area. When the needle is in the tip of the labia, you can use the same injection site to apply anaesthetic to the outer side of the labium. This is followed by applying anaesthetic to the remaining wound surface on the outside, again in small doses. As you see, we have now used half the content of the syringe. This equals 0.5 milliliters. If this is not sufficient, offer further pain relief. Manufacturers provide online product information for various types of local analgesia. You can search online by using the term infiltration analgesia.